Hello and welcome to today's demonstration of Access UK and Ireland. My name is Peter Dodd and I'm Newsbank's Regional Manager for the UK and Ireland. Today it is my goal to give you a quick glimpse of our resource as well as showcase some of the new features we have recently developed. As you click into Newsbank you'll be brought to this main landing page. Here the user has several different options to begin their work. If the user knows the source they wish to use and it is one that has been given a quick link by the library, then they can click on the relevant box. From this page, the user can either search for a particular topic using the search feature or click on the name of the resource they are interested in and then click on a date to browse and search a particular issue. If the source they're looking for isn't available via a quick link from the front page, then users can head to the A to Z source list and use the intelligent search option to find what they are looking for. Perhaps your user is focused on a certain geographical region of the UK and Ireland. If this is the case, then they can click on the map search and be directed to a map of the UK and Ireland where they can refine by source location. If the user wishes to search the entire database, they can plug in their search term on the front page and begin investigating hundreds of primary sources from the UK and Ireland. Once the user has entered their search term, they are presented with listing of results which match their criteria. From here, your user has the option to jump right into any of the results or refine their search further. On the left of the screen, you have several filter options, including narrowing by source type, year, source name, source location, language, and more. In each article, the search term is highlighted to showcase the piece's relevance. And we now include this read speaker feature, which will read the article for the user. Let's say, for example, your user is particularly interested in this article from the Birmingham Mail. We have options allowing the font to be enlarged. They can email, print or download the article. They can save to my folder, which Newsbank users can use to keep all of their favourite articles in one place and stay organised. They have the option to cite the article. They can export the citation to external sources like EasyBib and EndNote, or directly copy a citation in your preferred style. Lastly, they can copy the link to easily share the information with colleagues or students. The Access UK and Ireland package is designed to make accessing news approachable and reliable. In this digital age where library users often look to places like Google and Wikipedia, it is important the users have access to and are aware of primary sources that can be used in their reading and research. I appreciate you tuning in today for our quick glimpse at Access UK and Ireland. If you have any questions, please let me know. I'd be happy to discuss the resource further. Thank you and have a great day.